<sighs> For once, we're starting off an episode gently. Hey, how's it going, my fine sirs? My name is Sir Earl Grey, and welcome back to Dark Souls 3. Now, uh, sorry for not uploading uh, this Sunday. I spent the whole weekend in London after having an exam. I was out celebrating, as you can imagine. But we're back, and that's what's most important. And we're going to head back to the area after the bridge, because I think that whole area in the lava, all the pain and suffering I endured, yeah, I didn't think I was supposed to go there. I think that was kind of like a hidden high-level bonus area. So, yeah, we're just going to head back to the bridge and uh, see what we find. Nope, wrong place. Did not want to go there. <laughs> Fuck no, we're not going back to Smoldering Lake. That place was too much of a pain last time. Oh, <gasps> it's a second chance. No, shit. Whoa! What the fuck was that? I was like, it's gonna be my second chance to kick him off. And I just got absolutely wrecked. Ah. Okay, sirs, let's be cleverer this time. Let's approach him jet gently, gently. Come on, tippy toe, tippy toe. And then new pyromancy time. Come on, come on. Come on, yes! Oh, it looks like I'm grabbing his nuts and making them explode. Oh, that did nothing. Come on, man. Nut shots are supposed to be like, what's the word I'm looking for? It's supposed to be lethal. That's the word. Can't even English today. Okay, I'm really curious about this bridge. Will it collapse if I walk on it? Uh oh, oh, they would. What the fuck? No. No, no, okay, I'm just gonna go. I don't really care for an army of freaking skeletons running after me. <gasps> Wait, does this mean? Oh my god, please tell me it does. Come on, bridge! Break! There <laughs> you go! <laughs> That's freaking awesome! Oh, that was cool! Okay, all of this is new, sirs. Where are we gonna end up? More pots! <laughs> Jesus, guys, come on, you need to clean a little bit. This is almost as bad as my bedroom, actually. Oh, am I supposed to do something here? Here I was, breaking pots, and I was supposed to drink from a goblet. I think. Oh, that's some badass cup, man. I won it. Can you imagine drinking tea out of that? That'd be freaking awesome. Oh, shit. Not when ash pours from its eyes. If that is ash. I don't know, it looks kind of corrupting. I wouldn't touch it. Oh, come on, dude. Did you really have to touch it? Look what you've done. A miasma of death is coming towards me. I have chosen poorly. Now that is, if you get the reference, nice one said. Oh, it's like I'm in the abyss. That is a hand. And that has a ring on it. I don't know if I should hit the hand or I should get the object. And there's something in the darkness right there. Oh, okay. Um, it's a giant skeleton. Right, I knew that was, oh, 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 okay. Just poison gas of death, fair enough. Oh my God, he's gonna slap me. Ooh, no slaps for you. You've got some bling ass bangles though. Whoa, I just broke one of his bling things. That did a hell of a lot of damage. Oh, oh crap, oh crap. Slam attack, we'll break his bling. Break his bling. There you... No, that can't be it. That guy was freaking awesome. And I just killed him with like four hits. What? Okay. That was too easy. I'm sorry, Dark Souls, but... Like, that was... That was... That involved no thinking at all. Just hit the glowy bits, which is standard for any game. Right. Well, that was trippy. Whoa, what? Wow, look at this place. I know I gush over the visuals of this game, but this place is incredible. Incredible? Incredible. Can I just stay here? I've been to some really, really horrible places, and this place looks so magical. Look at it, it's like Disneyland. Just mixed with pixie dusts and dreams and fairies and all that is good in the world. Oh, I don't want to leave, but we have to. Our duty as a hero forces us onwards. Also, the continuing entropy of the world, you know, falling into darkness, kind of pushes you a little bit. Am I expecting, like, Snow White to pop out? Or maybe the witch offering me an apple. 
Bring a doll to be granted passage. Ooh, I have that from the Deacons of the Deep. Oh shit, I do not like the sound of that. Oh! Hi! Oh, stunned ya. Oh, stunned ya again. Well, you're going down, Teeth Man. Look, sir, whoever's screaming, I'm sure you're being tortured, and I'm sure you're in a lot of pain, but I'm kind of busy right now, okay? Whoa! What the hell was that? Your sword became a lightsaber. No, 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 drink. Shit. Damn, these guys are freaking Jedi. But they're skeletons. They're zombie Jedi. Jesus, that's a terrifying thought. Okay, sirs, let's try not to suck as much ass in this try. Can you stop twirling it, come at me? Oh, Jesus, not that fast. What the hell did you just drink? Whatever it was, you have incredibly bad breath after it. Fuck again! I barely had the chance to do anything! Just be preemptive, Grey. There you go. As long as you, if you get the first hit, they're easy. You just stun lock them. Come here, bro. What are you waiting for? You're waiting for me for sneeze? Because that's very like, very like, very likely. Ah, shit, no! Ah, oh, the fear made me stop. Oh, ho. Holy sh- What? <laughs> that guy has a freaking flamethrower staff. And he's got freaking- What? And he's making lava erupt from the ground. Okay, so these guys are the real threat. But if I come in close, you cannot do anything. There you go. You may be tall, but when you die, you're at my level. Only you is left now. Eh, eh, eh. Give me a kiss. Ooh, bonfire. Excellent. I'm loving this ruined cathedral, sirs. It's very atmospheric. But especially creepy, too. Not a big fan of statues of stone children wielding weapons. Oh my god, you are ugly. Nope. Nope. Not letting you transform. That death cry, though. That is bone chilling. Oh, I just got some bones. What the hell are you? <laughs> just a floating pair of eyeballs. You look dodgy as fuck. No. Go away, you pervert. Trying to catch me changing. I was in such a nice place, sirs. And look at us now. We're back in the dark depths. Why I can't see anything? I just know that floating eyes means enemies. Oh my god. That means there's a shit ton of enemies. To be honest, being invisible doesn't really help. Because it's so dark anyway. That it doesn't really matter. You know what, sirs? These areas really give the name to the game. Dark souls. Especially underlying the word dark. Oh shit, I'm being shot at. Why? Why? Why are not- Ah. Uh, I feel like I should really go down here and get that object, but I don't know what those floaty things are. And also, I don't know how I'm going to get back up. But it seems like going down into the marsh is inevitable, so... Go! Oh, what The fuck was that? It's like something from uh, The Evil Within. The woman with the long, lanky arms, and many of them. That's just not natural, man. Okay, sirs, I just have to hold out until the next bonfire. I think we can do it. I have no more healing items. I just need to survive. So, Grey, when you went to Irithyll, what did you go visit? The town hall? The museums? The monuments? Nabra? The sewers? Okay, let's be honest, that's where it's fucking at. Oh! Oh my god! I'm not dead yet. I'm not dead yet. I'm so close. I'm so close to death. Oh, and there's so many of them. Oh, I didn't want to come here. I just want to go home. Nope. 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 I feel it's right behind me. I, I can hear it. It's long legs clawing on the ground. Oh, it went back. Come on. Attack me, bro. Attack me. Oh, God. No, none of that spitty. That's the one. No! What did you do? You were too slow! Ah, oh, you really thought we were gonna make it. The, wor the worst thing is, like, as if these enemies couldn't be more terrifying, is that they float like corpses until you come near. That, that, that's just awful. Well, literally, the only thing I found down here is dung pies. Really? I know I'm in a sewer, but come on. I was expecting something more exciting, like alligators or something. Oh, <gasps> buddy! It's Sigmir! Oh, friend! Wake up! It's me! Let us make a toast. 
I like the sound of that. To your valor, my sword, and our sword this guy's a real bro. I like him. And he's gone back to sleep. <laughs> uh, talking to this guy is hilarious. <gasps> yes, bonfire, where were you? I needed you so badly five minutes ago. Oh, what? Come on, man. Sneak attack me. You are helping him. All of his accomplices shall die. No more fire, dudes. Oh, that was a great shot. What, are you fighting with your eyes closed? Oh, what? No! No, let me back! No, I didn't want to come here. I have a boss to fight somewhere else. Oh, no. There you go. All oh, this time in your face. I love that pyromancy. It's so freaking brutal. <laughs> Flatten like a pancake. Okay, sirs. This feels like I'm going in the wrong direction. So I'm going to go back to the big cathedral place first and kill whatever's there. Oh, this is fancy. This is a lot more to my taste. Why did I have to enter through the freaking sewers? Oh, this guy's admiring a painting. Oh, and that is the painting of, um... Do you remember, sirs, in not the last episode, the episode before that, I talked about how I was greeted by glorious boobs of a beautiful woman? Well, that's what I was talking about. Oh, fuck, what the hell was that to my left? Oh, there's a sneaky one up there. Oh, Jesus. Lightning swords, lightning swords, and giant arrows. Look at the size of that arrow in me. How am I still alive? Dude, fuck. Come on, you're not even letting me finish my insults or my threats. Dude, I'm coming for you. Just wait up there. I, I'm just going to get these huge ass spears removed from my torso. Oh, no, bro. You are not surviving this. Oh, let me just check your heart. Yep, heartburn. Definite cause is that you're invading too many people and pissing them off. So no fucking better. Can you guys stop shooting your shitty little spells at me? Thank you. This guy has a scythe. Oh, you look cool as fuck. He looks so epic. Oh, I can have a scythe. Oh, sweet man. Of course, I can't fucking use it, but still sweet. Hey, dude, do you want a free checkup as well? Nope, he doesn't. He really doesn't want the checkup. I'll give it to you anyway. Oh, in your ball sack again. Uh, it's because these guys are so tall. <laughs> <laughs> Do you see that comment? Time for tongue, and there's a statue bending over. Very clever, sirs. I like it. I walked straight into that. How am I this far into the game? I am a statue. No one will know the difference. Except when I attack them from the surprise. What does that even mean? Oh, oh, that seems fair. Freaking volcano beneath my feet. Hey guys, can you uh, come a little closer? I'd love to separate you. What? Even through the fucking rule? Are you fucking serious? Oh, come on. No, 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 no. No! How was I supposed to deal with two at the same time? Ooh, game. You will pay for this. Hehe, <laughs> boobs. Ow! You guys don't see anything. I am not the undead you are looking for. Look at this place. It's incredible. You think you're standing in front of, like, Sacré-Cœur or something, but actually no. It's an altar dedicated to death, to frost, to pain. Not a nice place, man, and how the hell do I get to you? All right, sirs, it's time for the boss. It's time to defeat whatever lies within this cathedral. Ooh. So peaceful. This is reminiscent of what this episode began like. Before the rage, before the anguish. Before the death. It feels nice to go back to your roots. Just appreciate the calm, tranquil nature. Right before the fucking storm. Jesus. Right, I am getting owned. Oh, shit. I How am I alive? Oh my god, can you stop attacking, please? Jesus Christ, how am I supposed to get an attack in? When he's literally a tornado of death. Yep, there you go. Okay, well, Pontiff Sullivan seems to be quite the swordsman. For a cleric, you would have thought that, you know, they'd be more magic-based or miracles-based, but no. 
In Dark Souls, they are everything's based. Oh my god, running past this place is crazy. So many things are happening. Death is literally pursuing me from left and right. Ha! You're stuck. Deal with it. Chatting with your boss now. Who looks so, again, so peaceful. And then suddenly he goes into beast mode. Anything that can help me around here? In this church? No? Okay. That's fine. Engage. Whoa! It like he goes into light speed and vanishes before your eyes. Oh god. No, 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 no. Oh, oh. Oh, I nearly avoided all of them. No. Ah, shit. This is such an intense fight, sirs. Oh, he's stunned. Oh god. Oh, okay. Maybe he isn't stunned. Because he's got freaking wing uh, wings. And <laughs> what laser beams now? <laughs> Come on. This boss was hard enough. Oh, what is he doing? Oh, what is he? No, not two. Come on. Kill him. Kill him. I don't know which one. Oh. oh. <laughs> Double punishment. We're progressing bit by bit, sirs. Whew. Just, just as if one wasn't hard enough. And off you go. Not so clever now, are you? I'm, I'm Batman. Batman. See? As long as you say it with a cool voice, you could be him. Because Batman could be anybody. No! Already? I barely started! So as I just realised, that it makes so much more sense to start off your try at a boss here. <laughs> I've been running all over the place, dodging enemies left and right. But in the end, this one was so much closer. Oh, it's, it's transforming again. I don't care if it hurts me. I just needed to get that extra hit in. The damage trade is definitely worth it. Oh, he's summoning his friend. Don't let him. Don't let him. No, what the hell was that? Why the hell did you kick him? That wasn't part of the plan. What the fuck are you doing? Whoa. <laughs> Fucks like meteors are literally raining from the sky. Dude, just come at me. I know you want to. I know you want my ass so much. Yes. Okay, the clone is down. I got hit by a little bit of life. I, I, I mean, I lost a little bit of life. But at least his clone is down. This seems doable, sirs. Come on. Will that health down? Shit, no. Ooh, Jesus, come on. Come on. One last more. Yes, sirs. Just when he was summoning a clone. Holy moly, that was fun. Okay, let's just light this bonfire and see what's over here. Oh. Come on, I was just about to do my outro, and I get invaded. Seriously. Oh, we've got a dildo bro. What's up? Well, at least he has good taste in weapons. I am the true master of the dildo Okay, sirs, I think we're going to end off this episode on a particularly beautiful sight. Just look at that. We've done a lot in this episode, and I feel like a lot has still to come. Um... There's kind of, I think in the next area, I don't know if we're going to go down into Irithyll's dungeons or we're going to continue up there. I had a peek and it looks terrifying. So I'm looking, really looking forward to the next episode. I think we did a huge amount in this one defeating, well, first of all, arriving at Irithyll, de um, defeating that giant skeleton, which, yeah, it was a disappointing boss, but it was an epic one all the same. And yeah, I think we've just done really well. So if you sirs are enjoying this series and enjoy this episode in particular, don't forget to bestow a like and to subscribe to become a sir today. So as always, stay cool, stay classy, and I will see you sirs in the next episode. See, everybody knows that the world is supported by trees. Yes, of course they are. Not only are these trees strong, but they are also on fire. Damn, what is this place? Invasion Central? I think I'm gonna get murdered here. A lot.